So I had told him the story about Baphomet, the goat headed demon coming into my bedrooms, and I didn't get into detail here on the radio because of the time frame, but I'll make it real quick for those that don't know. I'm laying in bed 3.30 in the morning. I remember the time. All of a sudden, I'm asleep. All of a sudden, I hear bang! And I, you know, kind of like, like this, stunned. I'm thinking, is this a dream or what? All of a sudden, I'm doing this. Thump, 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 thump. <laughs> and it's coming down the hallway. And in Texas, you got concrete slabs, you know, with carpet over the top, right? Yeah. It's monolithic slabs down there because it's got red gumbo soil, yeah. okay? A lot, of, a lot of soil. So anyway, I hear this. By then, I'm opening up my eyes. I'm laying on my back. I'm opening up my eyes. And I, I look, and I swear to God, this is the truth. Here's the aphomet I'll find out later. The goat-headed demon standing there, and I'm seeing the tail banging off the wall. I'm laying in bed. I'm seeing a banging off the wall, and I look at the head because I'm, it's banging and making that noise, and I look up at it, and it's got horns curled coming up out of its head, and the curls were a certain way. And I'm looking at this thing, and it's part of expression. It's masturbating in front of me. It looks like a pear for the shape from the head to the belly, and I can see off the bed its legs. And I see something unusual, but I didn't realize until, you know, a few years later, it was gold hoofs that he had on him and gold legs, Baphomet the gold-headed demon. All I could see was his nose. I saw from the knees up, the knees were backwards. That's why I remember, because I talked to somebody, this person, the saying. And I talked to some witch in Las Vegas, and she said, oh, you saw the goat? You couldn't have seen the goat. Nobody sees the goat, you know, like you, and lives through it, okay? Yeah. Well, I saw the goat headed demon. He's <laughs> here in the bedroom. And anyway, he's, you know, he's, part of expression, jacking off, masturbating, whatever you want to call it. And I'm looking at this thing, I'm saying, oh, my God. 